Hank, I'm going to ask you a question. Sure. How many water bottles do you think are thrown away in the United States every second of every day? Oh, Richard, I have no, I mean, I can't even comprehend that. 1, I don't know. 1,500. A second. Every second. Oh. That's 60 million bottles a day. Well, I'm going to write that down. 15 a second. No, 1,500 uh, a second. 1,500. Oh, 1,500 a second. Yes. A second, okay. And then how million, many in a year? 60 million a day. A day. Oh, my gosh. 35 billion a year. So do you think we might have an opportunity here? Well, I think so, but let's get another visual here. So if we take that one-day amount, 60 million, and we're to line the bottles up one uh, from the nose of the bottle to the tail of the bottle and line them up, it would go from San Francisco to New York and back. Wow. So that's wow. how much we're putting in our, in our landfills every day. Now, let me ask you this question. How much water do you think we should drink? Now, you probably know this because you probably heard me talk about this. Do you know how much water, mathematically, as a chemist, I tell people they should drink? Well, I they, I don't know. I was thinking uh, eight times, 64 ounces a day, 64 ounces a day. Okay. So I'll give you a mathematical formula because you know how Doc always bases everything on weight and things like that, right? Yes. So uh -huh. take your weight. I don't need to know what it is. Don't want to get involved with that. Divide it by two. That's how many ounces. Well, that's a good way to determine it, isn't it? Yeah. And so if, if you struggle, I'll tell you there's 16 ounces to a pint, 32 ounces to a quart, um, 64 ounces to a half gallon, and 128 ounces to a gallon. So now everyone can kind of get idea. So that's how much water you can take. So what... Steve and Longevity has decided to do is, A, we need to keep always giving back to our earth. It's, it's important. And we need to stay hydrated. So what Longevity's come out with is this bottle. And it, it's very much like a plastic bottle. It's pretty. It has our logo on it and things like that. Miss Deborah can probably describe it really well. But then you take off the cap. And if you unscrew the bottom half of the cap, inside is a filter. And that filter cleans out some of the heavy metals that are in water and some of the hard materials and, and, and things like that. So it's a filter. And then there's another space. And in that space, this is where Richard gets to have fun, and I'm going to have fun, people. You can put in these discs. And we're going to start making discs. Uh, for example, we're going to have a pH disc because if you study water, if you really want to drink ideal water, you want the pH to be greater than 7.2 and less than 8. But most of the water that we have in our taps are, is actually slightly acidic and under 7.2. So one of the tablets will help alkaline water. How about this? How would you like to have a, ta a tablet in there that has an org score, let's say 30,000? And it flavors your water, so it, it will take like, taste like honey cherry. Or how would you like to have something that tastes like lemonade and maybe have a little bit of energy from green tea and things like that in it? Or how would you like to have a tablet that you could put in there that will help you focus better and has a uh, cran raspberry flavor? Or let's say you just want to relax in the end of the evening and we have a lemon cam cam chamomile tablet. Can you think of all the different things we can do? We, we might even come up with a mild BTT tablet to put in there, or we could put in uh, 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 probiotics, or, you know, you guys, the, the, the sky's the limit. And we, everyone drinks water, or you should, and everyone has these plastic bottles you see in the trash bins, but instead of throwing them away, you just take them home, clean them, put in a new flavor tap, Fill up all the water and get your nutritional products out of there. Now, we're scheduled to have these available for all the distributors at the uh, third week in March. I don't know. I, I'll come right out and say I don't know how much they're going to cost yet. But I can tell you that 
there, there's the bottle, there's the filters inside, there's the tablets that come with it. I'm sure there's going to be a variety pack and the tablets will come with the bottle, your first order, and with the filters and whatnot. And then after that, you're going to see us over the next year or so keep rolling out with these tablets because I think of the 30 or so telephone calls that I take every day and talking to people, I would say easily 20 of them don't drink enough water. Easily 20 of them don't drink enough water. And I go around, and it seems like every single trash can you see at fast food places or on the street when you walk down to go to the theater and you take a little glimpse over, they're all full of plastic bottles. And that's really not good for our environment. So Longevity is coming out with this program where we're going to be able to kill two birds with one stone. And it's actually three birds because you're going to get hydrated. You're going to save the planet by putting less bottles in the garbage can. And we're going to be able to put nutritional products in these capsules and make them available for you. Now, the bottle that that they sent me has the 20th anniversary logo on there. It has the... Uh, uh, the Dominican Republican trip on it. I'm sure we're going to have different shrink sleeves that fit over it and whatnot. But uh, it, the, what's really important is this cap section. And it's got a flip top on top so that the water, if, you, if it falls over, doesn't spill out. Um, it's it's, it's multi-tiered uh, so that you can have the uh, filter in there as well as the disc, which will provide either nutritional products or, or, or just flavoring or pH adjusting. I mean, the sky's the limit. I mean, this is stuff that makes me all excited. And, and I've known about this for a little while, had to keep my mouth shut. But Steve says, A, you need to do a couple of things. You need to get your lecture out on people drinking enough water. So I guarantee you, probably the next time you hear me, you're going to hear me talk about why and all the functions people that have kidney problems or, and, and bladder problems and all that. Nine times out of ten, it's because we're not drinking enough water. People that have uh, their skin's too dry. Uh, odds on favor, they're not drinking enough water. People that have cardiovascular challenges, odds on favor, they're not drinking enough water. So on and so forth. We're going to have that lecture come out again, but we're going to have this product where we can put these caps in the uh, uh, top of the bottle, we sip it just like we do our water, and we get hydrated, we get nutritional products, and we save the earth. And to me, this is exciting stuff, people, and, and I'm really happy with Longevity with this coming out. So. Yeah, I'm sure on uh, the pictures, everyone will be showing off the bottles. Maybe we can get Deborah on here. I know that she had to climb stairs and climb over people to make sure she got her bottles. But <laughs> I did. I, I fought for it. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you, this this is a plus plus. This is a plus plus plus. And, and I'm really excited. I'm proud of Longevity for taking this step. You know, I hate seeing those plastic bottles in the trash can. And if we can just get one out of every five of the people we know to get a little extra nutritional products but drink them out of this bottle so they quit throwing the bottles away, we would be a lot better shape. You know, I, I'll give you another correlation. Uh, everyone's heard of Starbucks, right? It's estimated that 60 billion cups of Starbucks cups after people drink their coffee go in our landfills. Wow. 60 billion. And so, you know, in my mind, how can we lower those numbers? What can we do? You know, and, and, and one of my rotary friends actually has, it looks just like a grande cup, but it's washable and reusable. And, I, and I'm, I, I'm sending that idea uh, uh, today to David Brisky to come out with a longevity cup that's the same way, that, that looks just like a cup that you would get uh, to drink your coffee to go with, but it'd be a longevity one, and it would be washable and reusable so that we save our planet, save ourselves, save our children, and improve the quality of our lives. So, Peg, the new bottle's coming out. End of, November, end of March, it will be available. I hope I didn't say November the first time. End of March, it will be there for everybody. And please, 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 every time you pick up a plastic bottle between now and the end of November, just kind of count them and figure out how many fit in your trash can and how many trash cans you go away this next month before this product comes out because I think it can really make it be a game changer. Back